How to install OpenPixel in Visual Studio Code. If you're working on a project in Visual Studio Code and need to handle Excel files, you might be wondering how to install the OpenPixel library. Let's break it down step by step. First, you need to ensure you have Python installed on your system, as OpenPixel is a Python library. If you're using Visual Studio Code, you likely already have Python set up. To install OpenPixel, you'll need to use the pip package manager, which is the standard way to install Python packages. Here's how you can do it. Open Visual Studio Code and make sure you have the Python extension installed. This extension helps you work with Python files and manage your Python environment. Next, open the terminal in Visual Studio Code. You can do this by going to the menu, selecting View, and then Terminal, or simply by using the shortcut Control Backtick. Once the terminal is open, you need to activate your Python environment. If you're using a virtual environment, navigate to the directory where your virtual environment is located and activate it. For example, if your virtual environment is named inv, you would run inv scripts activate. On macOS or Linux, the command would be source inv slash bin slash activate. After activating your environment, you can install OpenPixel using pip. Simply run the following command in the terminal pip install openpixel. This command will download and install the OpenPixel library and its dependencies. If you encounter any issues where the package is being installed in the wrong environment, such as Anaconda instead of your desired environment, make sure you are in the correct virtual environment before running the pip command. Once the installation is complete, you can verify that OpenPixel is installed by running a simple Python script. For example, Import OpenPixel print, OpenPixel installed successfully. If this script runs without errors, you know that OpenPixel is installed and ready to use in your Visual Studio Code environment. With OpenPixel installed, you can now read, write, and manipulate Excel files directly from your Python scripts, making tasks like data analysis and report generation much easier.